Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. This is a, a video tutorial that is recorded from an outside camera so that I want to show you the perspective of the actual instructor who's copying everything and doing everything live on a PC. Let's start with creating an MPEG video from an existing PowerPoint slide. So I'm going to discuss this and creating a video from scanned uh, lecture notes, whether typed or, uh, or using uh, like handwritten or using mass word or something. And also uh, ways to negotiate doing handwritten explanation or doing problems as you go. So let's start with, let's assume you have a PowerPoint presentation. So this is your presentation, hope it's clear. It says here on the on the slideshow tab it says you can record slideshow and you can do all of these things you can use timed slide slideshow and this is on the primary monitor uh, first you might want to look at this setup slideshow if you want to do it by the presenter speaker or you can loop continuously you can choose the pen color or you can uh, custom made from one slide to another slide and you can advance the slides manually one thing I should tell you is to turn off this thing, the autosave, because you don't want to save the presentation after you've added your annotation and voice notes. You don't want to save your presentation uh, on the existing file or else it will take, uh, it will go from two megabytes to 25 or 45 megabytes. So with that done, I'm going to record the and slideshow. You can change the, uh, the type of the color of the font you can switch this on and off as you go you can mute and unmute the the microphone uh, and you can uh, you can uh, switch off the video altogether so with this i'm gonna start the presentation start the recording which is which will result in a video file so if you record this it will give you three to one countdown and then uh, it uh, it starts you can advance this as you please you can change the color and you can do uh, pretty much everything you need to do or you can pause by the way and and then you will have a chance to the save other it. method that we want to go over is when you have an existing uh, lecture notes like in uh, in word and when you start your video using your uh, whatever commercial software or whatever freeware software that you want to use, like uh, the one recommended by other professors, you go to uh, draw uh, whatever typed lecture notes or uh, handwritten lecture notes, scanned, for example, you could uh, open them up and say draw and you can uh, write whatever you want. If you need to do an example, you could in start a new document and you could do whatever you want using the same uh, mechanism. Uh, you click on MA and uh, you do this. Once thing. you have the video, either the one you created from, uh, from within the PowerPoint presentation, which is still saving, uh, or the one that you recorded using your own camera or uh, smartphone your teams page so you go to your uh, your teams you select your class and you go to the class notebook and uh, you'll, uh, you'll have a chance to select which one there's there are separate videos for this so you have to content library and and the usual way that uh, you've been uh, you've been taught how to do using other videos And there you have it as a video. The output is still within the oh, system. That's it. So this has to stop. And, uh, and with this, uh, we'll conclude our video on uh, uh, recording and, and sort of uploading your video lecture notes in the appropriate location. Thank you for watching.